Good morning everybody, even though it may be morning in your area or whatever time you're watching this. But today, we're going to go back to the shop. And it's not for my car, it is for the S14 that was there. We're going to go and work on the engine. I asked the dude if I could help him out again. He said, yeah, sure, why not? Because I thought, yeah, you know what, why, why wouldn't I offer to um, help him out when I'm pretty much going to be dealing with the... I'm going to be dealing with the same engine anyways, so... I may as well learn beforehand, which is pretty sick. Not many people get that experience. Either way, we're going to head down back to um, Rev Up Auto and we're going to help the guy out. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button, share it around, and even comment if you want. It really helps me out and we'll get straight to it. Okay, and so we have made it <clears throat> back again. Of course, it's like the third time coming here, but he doesn't really mind. It doesn't bother him, which is good. Alright, so we're back at the shop, and he's already working on it, putting on the manifold. Which turbo was that, that you have there again? Um, GTA, GTX 2867R. Nice. Is it good for these engines? Yeah, it's like the perfect size. Alright, so the things we've got to do next in this, so we'll get straight to it, is I'm going to put on the piping from here, and down basically the intercooler piping while he works on that side. Alright fellas, so <clears throat> my job was to slap this bad boy on, slap the clamps on, to connect it to the front mount. This is the charged side. So, and But he, on the other hand, was tightening up the exhaust manifold bolts to the engine. So that's pretty cool, we got that done. We took off the um, front bumper as you saw. He's pretty proud of his work. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's fun, but yeah, it's it's gonna be fun when I do it. But it's I'm gonna say it's a bit of a bitch, but yeah. All right, so what's next on the agenda? Um, the rest of the pipes, downpipe, air filter, lead the cooling system. Nice, nice. Yeah, this is this is I don't know, it's just tedious now because it's plumb back. So I've got to like line up everything. Oh. The pain in the ass. It goes from. And this is in the right spot. It goes from like there to there. Oosh. Yeah. It's a bit irritating. But it's coming along. It'll yep. be done. Other than that, we're gonna get straight back to it. It's a very nice. Look at this KNK filter. <laughs> On this side, this is what you put on the turbo for the good suck.
<laughs> Update on this sucker right here. That bit's all on. Very nice. Intercooler. Basically, it's all assembled now. Intercooler piping. That's all on. Blah, blah. Intakes on. Manifolds on. All of that's on. It's. I guess you could say it's pretty much ready to go. All we need to do is put the downpipe on. And I guess just like top up the fluids and stuff like yeah. that. Or drain it. Or flush it. And then put the front bumper back on. Yes. Yeah. What's up? Yeah, he agrees. I'm done. Doing vlogs. Oh, uh, yeah. Jaden, join my vlog. Introduce who you are. No. Oh. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Jane, this Jane is Jaden from Rev Up Auto in Malaga. If you guys, I recommend you 110% to go Ryan to this dude. Be so bad on here. Oh no, it's, it's all right. But I recommend you 110% to go for this dude because he does some amazing welds and stuff like that. He did some of the piping for the S14. Yeah. So other than that, all of this car is pretty much as I mentioned. It's all put back together. Main thing is just downpipe is left, top up the fluids, and the car should be ready to start. But I have to head off now because I do have work, which is annoying. Because I'd, I'd be here to basically see the startup of it. But it's pretty nice helping him out either way because then I, I got to learn a lot myself. But just over here, we've got the good old Rev Up Sylvia made in Japan. JDM import. Just kidding, it's not, is it? It is actually. Oh, it is an import. But he bought this thing. It's a very nice little like cover. Wheel tubs. Wheel tubs, that's the one. Been sitting here for like seven, eight years. So. Pretty much. And give it another 7, 8, and you would have like the exhaust installed, and that's it. Maybe oh, just okay. put the real muffler on. The motor sits over there. <laughs> Alright. In that case. Oof. Fair enough. People pay me to work on their cars, I pay people money for parts, so I don't work on my own car. Alright, well, that's a wrap up for today. We helped him out with his car. That was pretty awesome. Um. Yeah, so basically I'm learning experience from doing that, so I'll be able to do that on my own car. But for now, I would love to stay and see the car start up, but I have to go to work, which is unfortunate. Jaden at uh, Rev Up Auto, he's an awesome guy. I'll put a link in the description for him, or something, however you can contact him, or whatnot, but he does an amazing job here. If you ever need like somebody to weld you something, somebody to just, just do something for your car in general, he's an awesome guy, he does a really, really good job and he's literally shown us so much of the work that he's done and I've seen it in person how good it is. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys enjoyed this. Share it around and leave a like. That'd be awesome. It helps me out heaps. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to work hard and stay positive. Until you find your way back home.